We are Health Sciences University, and our goal is to help reduce health disparities within the community. We want to do that by increasing the number of African American, Black, and Hispanic Latino students enrolling and graduating from Samuel Merritt and eventually becoming healthcare professionals and serving underrepresented and underserved communities. There are health care disparities uh, everywhere in the United States, and I think particularly uh, pronounced in, in cities like this. Sixty percent of the patients that are on dialysis that have uh, kidney failure are African American and Hispanic. Not everybody has the equal amount of resources. One of the areas in which health care disparities still exist is in treatment. Even when a person goes in, the studies have shown that certain racial groups do not get the same treatment. Unfortunately, even though there is now supposedly insurance for everybody, there are still a lot of people who fall through the cracks. There are many people in the community who haven't had health care, haven't been to a doctor in years. Some people are in the country illegally. They're afraid about dealing with government entities. Outreach is so important because a lot of times people who are poor don't feel that there's anybody who really cares. And so you have to reach out instead of waiting for them to come to you. And Alan Chimple does that. The church should be a beacon of light. In the tradition of the African-American culture, people could come to the church for basically all of their needs. They were a resource center. The goal of the health education ministry is to provide health education to the parishioners here at Allen Temple and also to the community in East Oakland. While we're working on the spiritual aspect of our lives, it's God's wish for us to be healthy also. Prevention is the biggest thing that we can do. Eating well, exercising, being aware if you are more likely than not to be predisposed to another disease state. These are all educational things that we can do. And churches, given their historic place at the center of many communities, are great places where we can offer education out to people. We have an excellent partner in Samuel Merritt University. We partner with them because they have people who are training to be nurse practitioners, physician assistants, physical therapists, so they can come and help us to provide a myriad of services that we would like to have. It's all about giving back, especially when you're blessed with everything that you have. It's good to give back and help people out, and I see that as an opportunity for me to do today. And also, it's a great opportunity for us to get some clinical exposure by interacting with patients. You get to impact the, the kids around because they get to see that these are people in their neighborhood where they live, that they're doctors and there's dentists and there's you know, nurses and stuff. It's like, I can do that too. And maybe we're inspiring somebody to want to go out and do that. To walk into a room and see people screening kids, watching them do foot exams in the podiatry department, watching them do physical exams upstairs and seeing how many people want to help? How many people are willing to give up their Saturday and come together and say, it's not just about me, but it's about everyone as a community. It's extremely inspiring. We can take care of our brother and we should take care of our brother. And we should expect more and demand more. So when I come into an environment like this, it makes me excited to go back into the classroom and learn so that I can be one of those people who are going to help us get to the next level, who are going to be able to help us diminish those health disparities and be available for people to come and talk to openly and know that I'm not only going to listen to them and actually hear them, but be able to treat them.